You know, stuff like this where it's hard packed, there's no, there's no groove, no, there's nothing really to hit. You know, keeping in the middle of the bike, keeping your elbows up, keeping your leg off the ground, but more of it is just steady, consistent power, you know? Not getting on it too hard, not getting on it too late, not being too low of a gear. A higher gear on hard pack works better than a lower gear. It might not feel that way, but it, the, the tire is always tracking if you get... If you're in too low of a gear, the wheel's always spinning. And it's, that's one hard thing for people to get used to is kind of almost lugging your bike a little bit than always being on the gas where you can in uh, deeper, deeper dirt. If you come in braking hard with your front end, you're going to have a front end push. If you come in braking with your back end hard, you're gonna, the back end is going to want to come around. And uh, so if you come in with both of them uh, and be consistent and easy on the braking, you're gonna have you know good traction. Hard pack stuff, you can lock your brakes up, lock your tires up a lot easier than you can when it's when it's loamy. So again, everything is uh, is being very consistent and almost easy. Easy on the brakes, easy on the gas. In the middle of the corner, you gotta sit up front more because you gotta get that front end to track. You gotta put weight on that front end to, to stick. But when you're coming out, then you can slide back and get the traction uh, in the back end and keep that front end light. Now if this turn was flat and it had traction, you could get on it and be a little bit more aggressive, but with the flat, hard track, you gotta take your time. And coming into a hard, flat corner is better to do it 10 out of 10 times good than, than 5 out of 10 times. Now we do it race pace.